this is Wendy with Pretty Cool, and we're getting ready to go over to a family Valentine party at our Bases Youth Center. So I thought this would be a good time to show you the new box I received today. Well, new to me anyway. It's called the Out of the Box Sampler, and it is the theme Sweet on You Valentine Sampler. Now, this box just shipped in a regular priority mail container. Um, let me give you a word of warning. If you're bothered by highly scented items, if they trigger your allergies or make your eyes water, this may not be the box for you because there are a lot of highly scented items in here. I could smell them before I even opened the box. Now, they did wrap all of the scented things in a separate plastic bag so that the scent wouldn't get on any of the other items like food or things like that. So that was a good idea. I'm gonna set this down. I also wanna talk about this. This did not come in the box, let me say that first of all. However, when I signed up for this box and I was reading the description of some of the items that might come in it, I read that you might get a lot of wax melt type items and I didn't have anything to melt those with. So I went on Amazon and I found this wax warmer. I think it's from Glade. Anyway, green's my favorite color. So I found this pretty green one. And it's neat, you just plug it in and it has a little warming plate right here. And this dish sits on the top and you turn it on, you just put your melts in there and they melt and they put the fragrance out in the air. And of course, when you're done, you turn it off, let your wax cool, and then you can just, you can see I haven't cleaned it out from the last one that I used, but you just pop that wax out of there, and then you can put a different one in. So I'm gonna move this out of the way. Since it didn't come in the box, I just wanted to let you know, if you do decide to get this box, and you don't have one of these, you might wanna get one. Okay, I'll just set that there for now. Okay, there were over 20 items in this box. And this box specializes in handmade items that people craft in their homes or in a small business. Uh, you'll see here on this list of the February contributors they gave me, the vast majority of them have sites on Etsy, which we know is the main site to go to for handmade products. So that just gives you an idea of the type of items that'll be in this box. Like I said, there are over 20 items, so I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on each one but I've divided them up into categories and just to give you an idea. First of all, all of these items over here are either candles or wax melts. I love this little beehive candle. I've received something like this in another box before and it's just so cute and it smells good too. Um, we got lots of heart-shaped melts. Um, this one is called Mischief. We have, uh, again, an, uh, another, heart. oh, this one's like red hot cinnamon, like the candy. That smells good. We have one called Sheer Seduction. Mm. And here is a little one in a tin. It's called Death by Chocolate. My husband will like that one. Uh, hopefully you like that one too. But uh, we, this one is the cutest one. Oh, it's so cute. It looks like a little tart or a little cupcake or something. It's almost gonna be sad to put that in the warmer and just watch it melt away. But how cute is that? I think this was my favorite in this category. Okay, the next category I've kind of called um, bath, body, and beauty, all right? So I got three different lip balms. Now, you might think, that's a lot of lip balm, but we go through a lot of lip balm in this house, especially my daughter, Holly. Her lips are terribly chapped right now, and I actually had to yell her the other day, Holly, where's all the lip balm? Bring it back from wherever you stashed it around the house so I can uh, replenish this stash. We've got a pina colada one, we've got a mint one, and we've got a honey one, so three different flavors to choose from. We have some lovely bath salts here. These smell really good. I'm looking forward to using this one. We've got a great big bath bomb, that's fun. We have, um, oh, this is interesting. This is lavender vanilla solid perfume. I've never used solid perfume before, but that should be fun to try. We have some 
a regular perfume that was made using essential oils, so that's neat. Now here is my favorite item from this group. Look at this soap with this dragon on it. That is so cool. I'm going to have to put that on display for a while somewhere before I use it because that is just too neat. Uh, whatever mold or however they did that is really awesome. And I'll probably have to hide it from my husband because he'll try to put it in his collection somewhere. Okay, those were the main two categories this month. It being a Valentine's Day box. That's not surprising. Um, they do have food items fairly often. I think this month we only had two. We have a little, uh, a little lollipop here. And then this looks really good. I didn't open it up yet because I wanted to keep it away from all the smelling stuff. But this is Ken's Airy Crunch Peanut, peanut Brittle. I love peanut brittle. So I'm going to hide that so nobody steals it from me. Oh, Holly, you don't even like it, so... Don't give me that face. Yes, I do. Okay, now I have some miscellaneous items over here. We have this little crocheted circle, which is so cute. You can put a little, a little box on it or a little stand. It's a little figurine. It's just adorable. Uh, this is a sachet. It has these little beads in it. It's a scented sachet. It's saffron, cedar, and spiced mahogany. Aroma beads, and it's for putting in a drawer or a closet uh, just to keep things fresh, so that's neat. And then this is funny. This was the funniest thing in the box. This is from something called Antique Pet Photos. I'm going to take it out so you can really see it. Um, look at this. That is hilarious. I need to find somebody to give that to who really get a kick out of it. Um, actually, uh, if my dad were here, well, I'll tell you this joke. It's funny, okay? This reminds me of a time we were eating at a restaurant with my dad, my girl's calling Papa, and there was a deer head mounted on the wall. And uh, Holly said, oh, look at that deer up there. And my dad said, oh, that's Rudolph's brother, Randolph. And Holly says, I didn't know Rudolph had a brother. And Papa says, not anymore. So with that, I'll leave you with my first out-of-the-box sampler. I believe I'm getting four months of this box, so we'll have three more coming. Uh, maybe it'll give us a chance to see if on some months we get more of one type of item than another. And I hope you all have a great Valentine's Day, and see you next time.